You know, I hope that our, our conversation we're about to have with Selena Gomez, whose video you just saw uh, for her song, Who Says, maybe is a little pick-me-up and a little um, motivational tool for you today. Uh, if you want to go back to bed, we're going to be talking with this young woman who has probably not very much sleep in her life at all right now. Thank you for being here. We appreciate you saluting the troops, too. That was your song. Who says just went platinum? How do you feel about that? Crazy. I was very excited. I celebrated last night. It was, I couldn't believe it. Congrats to you. Thank you. Now, some people go, I, I, I didn't know she sang. I knew her as an actress, maybe from as far back as Barney and Friends. And now you have a new movie called Monte Carlo. Do we have a clip of that, guys? Do we have a, cl no. a clip from Monte Carlo? Those hungry people. Where are you? Mallorca. Hmm. If I leave now, I can catch a flight and be on the beach by the morning. No, I won't even check out. Mummy will think I'm off doing her errand. By the time she works out that I'm not there or here, she... <laughs> okay, now that's you, but do you play two roles there? I do. Okay, so what's the storyline? It's basically um, a case of mistaken identity. I play a girl from Texas who thinks that her life would be better if she traveled the world and got out of Texas. And we end up bumping into a British heiress that I also play, and um, we kind of switch lives with her for a little bit. Okay, and then someone blows the, the ruse later on, and that's yes, where all the fun and in, begins. Yes, intertwined, there's romance and comedy, yeah. so it's really fun and sweet. I thought it was really interesting that um, Selena may be coming to your hometown doing a, a mall tour. I remember the mall tours were like really popular like in the late 80s and the early 90s. Yeah. And then Avril Lavigne, and you're bringing it back. What's been the, the reception? What do you do at those mall tours? It's been awesome. It's been crazy. It's been really fun to kind of, you know, you obviously have to do a thousand interviews promoting something. But the, the core audience that's going to see it, it's, it's my fans. So it's nice to kind of go to different places and go to the malls and see them and yeah. talk to them. And we, I, they ask questions about the movie and I get to meet them. It's fun. So do you do meet and greets there, or do you sing there? You put on concerts, well, you shop with them. What? Usually, it's kind of. <laughs> usually, I wish I could you know, shop with them. Uh, usually, there it's kind of with the radio station, and they go on stage, and they get to ask questions, yeah. and I get to thank them for coming out and talk about the movie. Yeah, you know. Um, we're, we're coming to you this morning out of Atlanta. That's where our show is from. And I was reading the local newspaper and it said, Selena's here with Justin Bieber. They get to spend a little time together. Do you get tired of people asking about the dating life with Justin Bieber? Uh, I mean, obviously, it probably comes with the job more than anything. It kind of confuses me, but I just try to focus on the things that make me happy. And I try to focus on like my projects and films and things like exactly. that. Exactly. Okay, now speaking of your films and your projects, one of our viewers has a question for you. Awesome. Hey, Selena, I'm Marcus from Connecticut. I've been your fan since the beginning, and I just wanted to ask you, how are you able to balance TV movies, music, being a teenager, and being so awesome. <laughs> He's a little biased, huh? Nothing That's wrong sweet. with that. That's very sweet. Uh, I sometimes don't know how I, I guess I do. I get really tired sometimes, but I, I love what I do. So it's a lot of what I love, and each project that I'm a part of, I try to commit, and I'm very passionate about it. So I guess I just really love my fans and my job. Well, I'm glad that you love what you do. You mentioned that you get tired a little bit.